Okay, let's come to the, the contenders we're seeing. Let's start with the chairmanship race. We're seeing that Stephen Tim and Stephen Asamoah Boateng appear to be the main contenders. Yeah. Where are you aligned to? Me personally? Yes, you. Look, I have listened, I mean, all of them are my friends. I've listened to um, Asabi's message, and I think that he probably has the best message. I have to be clear. Okay. He has the best message. What was his message? But uh, my, really sympathies, my sympathies are with, with, within team. Yeah, you are yes. team in team. Yes, but I, I, I think Asabi has, has a strong message. Very strong message. He's on point. But my sympathies are within team. Okay. General Secretary slot. Where, where, where are you aligned? General with? Secretary, I have sympathies for John Bordeaux. Okay? But he has a challenge. Okay? And I think the challenge is based on incumbency fatigue. When you are general secretary of the, of the party, all the problems, if you had a chairman also running, he would have had difficulties. Okay? Because they've been there, they were there in 2016, they were there in 2020, and they want to be there in 2024. It creates its own issues. You've stepped on so many toes. You get me? You have, because you can't satisfy everybody. And there's clearly incumbency fatigue. So that's where the challenge is. Why do I have sympathies? It's not that I have sympathies for him. Strategically, I think the party has to be careful. And this is why I say so. You are going to have a new chairman. You're going to have a new national organizer. You're going to have a new youth organizer. Okay? You're going to have a new treasurer. And the key, these are some of the key positions. The general secretary and the chairman. So if you have a new chairman and a new general secretary, and you are going to contest an election and try something that had never been done before, I think institutional memory, the network, the experience has been gained. If we lose in that, it may create its own difficulties. But I believe in the collective wisdom of delegates. They've heard the messages from all the candidates. If in their collective wisdom, it should go to Superior, it should go to Kodia, it should go to um, who else? Who are the, who's, the, who's the other candidate? Or Pariansa. Or it should, or they, they think that they are satisfied, even though they had challenges with John Bwadu, they think that it is in the, in the interest of the party to maintain him to work with the new chairman and we're definitely going to have a new chairman because the incumbent didn't fight. If in their wisdom, whatever they choose, I believe that we can work with.